Sage Kimsey is your round seven bull riding champion. Sage, you had that bull before and you kind of wanted a little wrench. Tell us about it. Yeah, he threw me off at Houston. I actually drafted him in, in one of Houston's uh, progressive rounds and he threw me off. So there's definitely a little bad blood. He's got a, a really tough move right out of the box. Big roll right there. And uh, I knew if I could get through that, that it'd be pretty smooth sailing afterwards and uh, weathered the storm and it did. It got fun after that. Okay, you're number one in the um, average, number one in the Ram World standings. We haven't seen you down here for a round win, but you've definitely been just kind of chipping away at it. How are you feeling, and what's the game plan for the rest of the week? Yeah, it's been kind of just slow and steady and just taking care of business. But, uh, I mean, really, that's kind of just been my whole career. I've, I've just a guy that just stays on a lot of bulls, and uh, coming into the week, that was all I wanted to do was just stay on all ten of them. I uh, had a little slip up, but nine's nothing to shake a stick at for sure. So I'm, I'm excited. I uh, feel really healthy, really good. feel like I'm riding really good, really focused, and uh, it's all good. Now your little brother's out here with you this year. How does that change things, and how special is that? Uh, it just makes everything a lot easier, honestly. I mean, uh, th th there's no level – uh, of being comfortable in the Thomas and Mac per se but uh you know whenever he jumps out and pulls my rope uh like he's done hundreds of times throughout the year it's uh it's pretty good and it is it's just like kind of like you're getting on at home and uh, it does it kind of knocks the edge off takes the nerves out of it and it's just all fun well congratulations and we look forward to seeing you back down here thank you